I figured because I jumped straight into the fire with the first episode of this series, I should do it more in moderation. I decided to go with arguably the easiest of all the plants to solo, the pea shooters. Excluding the split pea because I might as well use it when it's actually useful. These were actually way harder than- just kidding. They were really easy. I started with a snow pea shooter. The main challenge with anything over a hundred sun is risk versus reward. Are you going to plant another sunflower for the potential reward of more sun later? Or are you going to save sun so you can plant defenses as quickly as possible? This is very short term though, because the second you get all the rows filled, there's no challenge. After that I did the pea shooter and repeater, which were both almost identical. Saving a bit more sun initially with the repeater, and the space needed for a lot of pea shooters makes it a tiny bit more challenging, but past that nothing changes. I saved what I thought would be the most challenging pea shooter, the three peter, for the end, but it wasn't even hard at all. If I couldn't use any lawn mowers, it would be complete luck in the beginning, but because I can, it's simple. Just let one zombie through so you can rack up enough sun to plant one three peter, so it can cover three rows and wait for more sun and plant another to cover the other two rows. After that, you can just place them willy-nilly and you'll be fine. Here are the highlights. I ruined the bottom. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Yes! Yes! That <laughs> didn't go the right way, guys. Dang it. Oh! Oh my goodness, two sand garden plants already. That was freaking fast. There's so many coins! No! No! Ah! That's too late! Woo! I don't have a chomper yet. I do have a walnut, but the thing is, because I can grow this, I'll just sell this one. See ya! If I were to give all these plants a difficulty from 1 through 10, Pea Shooter is a 1, Snow Pea and Repeater are both a 2 for the difficult start but easy finish, and the 3 Peter is a 3 for the harder start but still an easy finish. Just to give you guys an idea of how hard the potato mine was for me, I'd give it around a 9. As for the Gatling Pea and other upgrade plants, I think they're worth a shot. But the regen time combined with the fact that you can't use imitator for them makes it improbable and or impossible for most of them. That's for another time though.